Hello friends, welcome to our channel. Today, we will dive into the depths of the past and introduce you to five wild animals that lived years ago. If you are ready, how about embarking on this historical journey with us? The dire wolf is an extinct species of wolf that lived in North America, leaving its mark during the Pleistocene epoch. Resembling gray wolves, but slightly larger and with shorter legs, an average adult dire wolf measured 1.5 meters in length and had an average shoulder height of 76 semitoton. Adapted for hunting large prey with its powerful jaw structure, these wolves typically hunted in packs, capturing large herbivores and carnivores such as mammoths and bison. Numerous fossils have been discovered in various regions of North America, particularly around Rancho La Brea. While it is often portrayed in popular culture, as seen in works like Game of Thrones, these depictions are generally not based on scientific facts. Although the exact reasons for its extinction remain uncertain, climate change and decreasing prey resources are believed to have played a role. The dire wolf is remembered as a species of historical significance, characterized by its captivating appearance and its association with the wild atmosphere of the Ice Age. Smelodon, a giant carnivorous creature from the Pleistocene era, is a well-known wildcat species recognized for its long, saber-like teeth. Physically resembling a medium-sized, powerful and muscular body, Smilodon fatalis is one of the most notable species that inhabited North and South America. This impressive creature is distinguished by its evolved saber teeth, specifically adapted for hunting large herbivores. However, approximately 10,000 years ago, during a significant extinction event at the end of the Pleistocene era, Smilodon became extinct. Fossils found in regions like La Brea tar pits have provided valuable information to scientists about the anatomy and lifestyle of Smilodon. Even today, Smilodon remains one of the fascinating creatures of the prehistoric world, capturing the attention of scientists and animal enthusiasts alike. The cave bear, or Ursus spileus, is a large bear species from the Pleistocene period, known for its preference for living in caves. Physically robust, these bears were characterized by broad shoulders, short tails, and blunt noses. Cave bears inhabited cold climates in Europe, Asia, and North Africa, often choosing to live in caves, especially in mountainous regions. Their diet primarily consisted of vegetation, showcasing herbivorous tendencies, although they were believed to have some hunting capabilities. Typically solitary creatures, they navigated their environments independently. Towards the end of the Pleistocene period, climate changes, habitat loss, and decreasing prey availability led to the extinction of this substantial bear species. Research and fossil records related to cave bears provide paleontologists with valuable insights into their anatomy, behavior, and evolutionary history. Archaeological findings and fossil records underscore the enduring interest in this species within the scientific community. Glyptodon stands out as a giant mammal from the Pleistocene period. Belonging to the Glyptodontidae family, these animals lived between 2.5 million to 10,000 years ago and had an evolutionary connection with modern armadillos in the Cingulata order. The key features of Glyptodon include a large structure surrounded by a robust shell, the unique design of this shell, and adaptations to various regions in South America. Glyptodons with herbivorous traits gracefully grazed on vegetation, drawing attention with their large size and thick shells that primarily provided protection against dangers. They faced extinction at the end of the Pleistocene due to factors such as climate change, human influence, and alterations in vegetation. 
Fossil records have provided scientists with significant insights into Glyptodon's anatomy, behaviors, and ecological roles in South America. Glyptodon, as a captivating part of prehistoric mammalian evolution, has left an unforgettable mark on the Pleistocene landscape of South America. Tasmanian tiger is an extinct marsupial species. It had a dog-like face and a dense fur with long stripes on its back. Pumalis had a pouch to carry their young, typical of marsupials. This species, primarily found on the island of Tasmania, could inhabit various habitats. It was a solitary creature, mainly hunting at night, with its prey including small mammals, birds and insects. Due to hunting by farmers to protect livestock, their populations declined in the late 19th century and the last known wild individual died in 1930, leading to the complete extinction of the species. The Tasmanian tiger served as an important model species for understanding the evolutionary history of marsupials. Despite its extinction, photographs and images of this species played a crucial role in raising awareness about biodiversity and species conservation issues.